There's a lot of new dog owners out there. If you live in the city, you'll know what I mean. If you live in the suburbs, you might have an advantage because you don't have to deal with those first-time dog owners. You know, people that say stuff like, oh, having a dog is like having a kid. No, it's not. The dog's not going to college. No, you're not going to college. And the dog is not going to sneak the car out at two in the morning. No, dogs are more like having a half kid, a forever first grader who only gets more tired as the years pass, never to graduate to the second grade. Here is Luna. Do you think we have to be on guard when we walk her here in San Francisco? What do you think? You gotta know the weirdos out there. Look at the owner, then look at the dog, then look at the owner again. They'll give it away. And when you're trying to get by an angry, muzzled dog, and the owner says, Oh, he's just a little... When you hear those words, He's just a little... Keep moving. Pick up the pace. You also might hear, Oh, he's just a rescue. And you might reply, Well, let's hope he doesn't bite the wrong person, because you might need to be rescued. And keep moving. Always keep moving. Don't forget to bring your doggy bags when you leave the house. One for your dog, one for you, and one for the guy who forgets. And there's always someone that forgets. I live in the city, I know. Just take a look at the sidewalks. Who leaves their house without bringing a bag, huh? Everybody here wants to go green, but we don't want to go brown too. Some people love to call out the breed when you pass by. What a cute pug! Adorable pug! Why not just say cute? Or better yet, nothing at all. Because I'm not out here to make friends. I'm out here because my dog needs to do her business. And how can she when you're distracting her? Kids especially love to proudly call out, Pug! Pug! Puggy! Puggy! That's great, kid. But you don't get the lollipop because pugs are pretty common. Can you guess this dog? Or this one? How about this one? No, I didn't think so. Now you might be thinking, gee, this dog owner, what a pain in the ass. He's uptight, he's kind of jerky. And you'd be right. But Luna is the star of the show, not me. Luna or Pound Cake or Toasty Joe, whatever name I give to these inquiring minds, she's the star. They're not looking at me and pointing and saying, Italian-American, Italian-American. No, she's the star. I'm the caddy and she's the star golfer. And when people say nice things, I just tip my hat. Because she can't. Yes, I'm a dog owner again. We took a six-year hiatus. Was it worth it? Absolutely. But somebody in the family wanted a dog very badly. And this someone is too young to drive, but not too young to walk the dog. Does she walk the dog? What do you think? <laughs>